So I'm here at the Teatro Rossetti with Alan Jones, the director of the Trieste Science Fiction Film Festival uh, 2022, and uh, we're coming to the last day. So Alan, how do you think it went? I actually think it went really well. What I've been really surprised by is the warmth of the audience towards me. I mean, I mean I'm this new guy on the block. I came along, um, you know, I sort of shook it all up and I sort of like made a lot of changes. And some people did resist that. And I was hoping the audience was really going to go along with me um, because I know they wanted science fiction. And that's exactly what I programmed. Um, real solid stuff from all over the world. And I've been really heartened by when I've gone out on stage and there's, I can feel it. It's interesting, the wave of like support and sort of like, well, love almost. I'm, I think we're going to see that more tonight at the closing ceremony. But, uh, you know, I know I'm doing a good job. I'm just pleased that other people think so too. Uh, science fiction horror is a very uh, enthusiastic crowd, I suppose. And obviously with the background from Fright Fest, which you still manage, uh, was there particular crossovers with Trieste, things you took with you, or was it a bit of a new canvas? No, no, surprisingly. Um, science fiction films have sort of been very, you know, high on the ground this year. So it really was a case of uh, sharing a lot between Fright Fest. For example, The Lair, The Visitor from the Future, um, you know, New Religion. I mean, it's, it's never usually that much of a crossover, to be honest, but in this year it was. Won't be the same next year, I don't think, but you never know. But no, so it's all good. I mean, I see films anyway to program for Fright Fest. Um, so if I could see one that's going to program for both, perfect, saves my time. <laughs> it's very efficient. <laughs> and um, <coughs> so j just leading on, because I appreciate you have to go and manage things. Don't worry, um, don't worry. In terms of uh, how you see this progressing for next year, you said you're here for three, four years. So uh, what lessons learned from this one for, for 2023? Um, the lessons learned from this year going forward is because next year is the 60th anniversary. It's a real big, big one. And so I'm going to make sure that it's going to be full of really, really sort of like blockbuster events, major films. To be honest with you, we've already got quite a lot planned already. I mean, I've asked a couple of major guests to come already because I, should, I want everything in place. And the people that we need, need to know a year in advance, um, as much as that sounds really ridiculous, they do, um, because they might be filming and stuff like that. But no, um, it's got to be bigger, it's got to be better. We'll make sure we do it, because this is the oldest film, science, film, science fiction film festival in the world. And I want to make sure that it actually sort of like continues that way and gets even bigger and better. Right. Any, any hints as to who these people might be I, next year or T TBD? TBC. I, I can't possibly <laughs> tell you anything about next year just yet, but as I told another film crew today, um, all you've really got to look at is have a look at what's sort of coming up to his 50th anniversary next year, and that'll be a few that you'll be able to sort of like guess at. So you never know. So, um, yeah. I'm, I'm all... racking my brains now to think <laughs> which one that might be. But it, anyway. No, it's, it's, seriously, it's all good. I mean, I love Trieste, I love the audience here, they're very respectful. Um, all the guests we've had, many of the directors have said to me how, you know, really, really well treated they felt, not just by us, because that's part of what we have to do, but by the audience and the way they've been responding to the films has been so great that, you know, I think it's all good and it's going to build on that for next year and, you know, people realise that what we've done here is very good and I think next year they'll think, I want to go back because it was so great and let's see what they do this time. Fantastic. Any particular highlights of this year or lowlights? I think one of the uh, highlights for a lot of people was the Vespa drone being flown on the stage. I mean, you know, we were, you know, really pleased that worked. Um, we couldn't fly it over the audience as much as we wanted to for some insurance purposes, but it was a really, really great thing to show. An, act, an actual prop from the film being flown on the stage was terrific. Um, the quality of the movies has been really good. I mean, I'm lucky enough, obviously, because I'm about to announce them. I know the, uh, the films that have won, mm. and I'm really, really delighted by every single choice, I have to tell you. I mean, the jury's done us proud. There is a one dodgy title there that I thought, <laughs> oh God, why did they choose that? But in this case, everything's really good. Okay, there's always one thing that isn't quite quite what you expected. Uh, and uh, fantastic. Well, any, any closing thoughts? I think everyone's enjoyed it very much. Certainly I have the films I've seen. Uh, I didn't wear my Obi-Wan costume, didn't get around to it, but would have done, will do next year. Uh, any other closing thoughts for the interesting no, magazine? No, I mean, I, I, look, it's gone 
it, look, I'm not going to say it's gone better than I thought it was, because I've, I've been programming festivals since the mid-80s, so I know how it works and how it doesn't. But I mean, you know, I've been uh, really pleased with the way this has gone relatively smoothly. We had a couple of audio problems with one of the films yesterday, but that was easily sort of sorted out. I mean, these things happen, what can you do? You know, you just have to get on and deal with it. And luckily the audience is with us. But no, there's been really nothing dramatic like that. It has been a, a very much a breeze, and uh, I thought it would be. Fantastic. Well, thank you very much, Alan Jones. I hope the award ceremony goes well this evening and looking forward to meeting you, seeing you the films next year.